I have created a lesson um, about a book, uh, a novel we're going to start reading um, in my class in the next few weeks. Um, I have divided the activities into three sections. These are the activities the students will do on the platform. Obviously, there will be some more activities to do in class in the face-to-face -face session. Now, um, the first thing you can see is a um, label. I have inserted a label uh, with the title of the book and then an image uh, as an introduction to the topic. Then you have three sections. The first one is the introduction to the to the author and his works, then the novel itself, and then some wrapping up activities. Now, um, again, this is another uh, label. Then I have inserted um, a link here. It's a, it's an external website. So if you click here, you will have the external website. Then uh, there is a quiz uh, students have to do. Um, it's a very simple quiz. Is a yes no. Is a yes no. Yes no quiz. So you click here, and uh, as you can see, is a yes no uh, question. So it's it's very 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 simple. Now, uh, if we go back to the previous uh, page. Uh, after the quiz, I have opened a forum in which students have to uh, watch uh, a video of the author. And then after watching the video, they have to uh, insert some comments about the a bit unusual working habits the writer has. Um, then back to the course, I have inserted um, a hot potatoes exercise. In these hot potatoes exercises, exercise, sorry, students have to match the characters and the uh, what they represent in the in the novel. So it's a very very simple <laughs> activity. Now um, back to the back to the course. Uh, after that, I have inserted uh, a page. Now, in this page, uh, there is again a photograph, some information, and some uh, links that open up uh, on a new on a new page. Um, right, going back to our course. After that, we have another forum. Uh, in which students reflect on uh, the most famous, uh, the, the most common topics in in the book. Um, then, um, after the the forum, um, I have uh, inserted another uh, page in which um, there is a uh, a title some information and I have inserted um, a YouTube uh, video. Now, um, oops, that's not the one, that's not the one, that's okay, yeah, it's here. Right, um, then in the final section I have uh, created uh, an assignment in which the students have to submit um, um, a file. Right. Um, students have to add a submission, and they would put it here. Right. Now the the the, the title of the assignment is "Why is uh, Mrs. Ramos such a remarkable woman? She's the main character in the in the in the novel." And then to finish, I have uh, created. Um, uh, um, a, a survey, I think it's the choice tool, and it, it won't it won't be available unless the previous activity is marked as complete. Um, as about completion of activities, I have, as you can see, there are uh, some activities need to be uh, have certain conditions to be marked as complete as completed, 
Um, some of them need to submit the assignment or have to be seen or have to receive a grade and some others like this one uh, can be marked manually. Depending on the type of activity, um, I have chosen one or the other. Now, this is basically what I've done. Um, uh, I have found it very interesting, um, uh, so especially um, um, the new characteristics I have found because I'm used to um, the old, an older version of Moodle and I found that the, some of the activities here have more possi possibilities than the, the Moodle version I'm using. So um, I hope you liked it and thank you very much.